Hey, what's up? This is your boy, Big Man. You already know what it is, man. So let's check out these latest headlines out here, man. Now, something that's going on in hip hop right now that's really taking up all the headlines today is this YSL Rico case, man. And the crazy part about it is when you thought, you know, the biggest ordeal would be the case taking part, Young Thug potentially going to jail or whatnot, it's more deeper than that, man. Because one of the YSL rappers, Yak Gotti, his mother just got arrested, and I am not joking. So let's actually look at this headline. And for those of you who don't know, man, let me go ahead and pull up a picture of Yak Gotti. Now, Yak Gotti is one of the cats with YSL who's been talked about a lot, right? So this is Yak Gotti. And his name was brought up during the whole YFN YSL beef because he took a picture standing on top of YFN Lucci's car one time and dissed him while leaving them all, right? Now, Yak Gotti has been getting the same treatment as Young Thug. It seems like he's not taking any type of deal in this situation. It seems like Yak Gotti is going to try to stand on it or whatnot and try to fight this in trial. But something took place that's got everybody talking about Yak Gotti and got everybody talking about Yak Gotti's mom. Now, I don't mean that in a disrespectful way, but, but this story you're going to see is kind of crazy. So let's actually look at the news story about this. So as you can see here, it says mother of YSL rapper Yak Gotti gets arrested after smuggling tobacco to, to Gotti in courthouse. Police also looking for Gotti's baby mama due to her involvement. Now, as you see pictured there, that is Yak Gotti and his mom. So his mom got booked as well as him because she is accused of trying to sneak in some contraband to him. Now, I thought tobacco and things like that were, were all right in jail. Maybe not. I don't know. It's a different time. I'll, I'm using what I know based off of reading things, but it looks like that's a big no-no. And the fact that it was something that could be used for other drugs is really what's, what took the cake in this situation. Yet Gotti, now the story goes on to say this. It says, Yet Gotti's mother and baby mama smuggled drugs to him in court. Now, to think about that, how wild is that? Who would do that? Only in a hip hop Rico case would you hear something this crazy, man. You got a mom and somebody who has a child by Yak Gotti risking it all to bring him drugs into the court. But it gets worse. So let's continue. Now, on Thursday, Young Thug's YSL Rico trial trended heavily. This was due to a co defendant of his passing Thug a Percocet. This was immediately retrieved by deputies as the co-defendant was Khalif Adams. Adams even attempted to eat the rest of the drugs to avoid being caught. Therefore, he also went on to be treated at a local hospital. As a result, prosecutors filed a motion where it stated that the hearing was delayed due to the incident. So this is a whole nother situation that took place with one of Young Thug's co-defendants, a guy by the name of Khalif Adams. Now, Khalif Adams ended up trying to pass something to Young Thug, they're trying to say. But, you know, Young Thug's attorneys, they've come back to combat that. But And you'll see about that. We'll talk about that on, on another video. So the story continues by saying this. It says, however, there is even more drugs being smuggled in court in this YSL case. According to the local news there, YSL rapper Yak Gotti's mother, Latasha Kendrick, was also arrested on Tuesday for attempting to smuggle tobacco to Gotti. So it looks like his mom was trying to smuggle tobacco to him and it got intercepted as well. I don't know why anybody would be this bold or brazen. This is crazy. Why in the world would you be trying to smuggle something to somebody in jail? You know they got cameras. You know that their whole job, the whole premise of jail is security to make sure that nobody gets out and nobody gets in that they don't want. They're going to have security measures in place, but obviously they were trying to overlook that. Now, it goes on to say this. It says police went on to charge her with one count of criminal attempt to commit a misdemeanor. Kendrick is now in the Fulton County Jail. Gotti's baby mom, Nisha Cox, also has a warrant out for her arrest for her involvement. So now you just made a bad situation worse. This is a shame because yet Gotti is already facing charges in this RICO indictment. Then you have two members of his immediate family close to him who are going to be potentially locked up as well. So who's going to be out there to look after everybody who they have to look after is what I'm saying. Now it continues to say this. It says, as for Gotti, 
Prosecutors state that he is who murdered Donovan Nutt Thomas. As many know, this is the close friend of YFN Lucci, who has been feuding with Thug for almost seven years now. Thug is also facing eight out of 65 charges in the RICO case. With that being said, this is crazy because on one hand, you have the whole YFN Lucci situation going on, right? You have the back and forth between YF and Lucci, YSL, that was in the streets, obviously a deadly beef out there in Atlanta, right? Then you have the situation where Yak Gotti is already being accused of, of shooting YF and Lucci's homeboy, Nut, which pretty much started the whole beef. It seems like it was the catalyst to start a lot of things in this beef and made it even worse. This is when the dissing began. This is really the start of the Rico right there. I mean, we, there's even been a cop who's come out and talked about that and said that's when he got his his uh, antennas went up and when he started to think about charging a Rico or starting a Rico investigation on YSL and YFN, man. So this is crazy, man. And yet Gotti and his mom, it seems like they've only made a bad situation even worse. But y'all tell me what y'all think in the comments, man. Do y'all think that yet Gotti possibly you know might get off of this or do you think man when it comes to smuggling and contraband and things like that they probably got him on tape they probably got enough evidence and they already got a warrant out for his baby mom so it could only get worse from here now with that this has been your boy big man do me a favor make sure you hit that like button make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you hit that notification bell so that way you get a notification every time i drop this hot content and we out of here peace